in this WHMCS installation tutorial, I will show you uh, how you can like install the WHMCS in both cPanel and Plastic. So in this tutorial, I'm going to take it through step by step. So first, uh, uh, you can see I have opened uh, both panels here. Like the first one is cPanel and second one is Plastic. So uh, first, I will show you how you can install the WHMCS in cPanel. So first, I have created you know so a subdomain for testing. Uh, this is my subdomain I have created. So you can see here. I will go here, and then I will upload my WHMCS file. I need WHMCS uh, for which is the latest version. So it will take some time until that we will create that database. And simply you have to here and sorry. We can go for the creating new database for the WHMCS. Like I will put the WHMCS 999. Okay. This will be our WHMCS name, database name, sorry. Uh, after that, we have to create the user, and I will put the same name for the user, okay? And for the password, I will put anything. Then I will create the password, and then we have to assign the permission and make the changes. So that's it. Now go back to your uh, uploading file. Uh, maybe it will take some time and. Till that, I will show you how you can uh, do same with the plastic. In plastic, I will go to File Manager, and here I will upload my WHMCS file. Uh, same one, WHMCS eight. So it is completing now, so please wait. Okay, you can see it is uploaded now and just to simply extract it here. So once you upload the file, uh, just simply go to your domain name uh, so it was the test domain which is labs dot okay now it will show you to install the WHMCS simply you had to go and agree it and then install and put license and here put your WHMCS name sorry the database name and how you can find it You can go to database. And here is your database name. And here I will put the database password. Then I will click on the continue. So you can see WGMC is installed, you put your name, like system, admin, then put your email, like info, data. Oh, okay, so you can put username anything. Admin, okay, the password you can put anything like uh, Anything minus anything. Then click on the complete the installation. Okay, and now your WHMC is installed, but uh, you have to set the corn job. So simply go back to your cPanel, then search for the corn and add here your new corn. Okay, simply click here and add one as a permit then enter your command line then add this column okay 
so this is very easy and one more thing you have to do you have to you know delete this installation folder once you delete it then simply you can go your admin panel and here I will put the admin that was Shahid admin the password was similar something and just log in into your WHMCS and boom this is installed and now you can manage your WHMCS here so here is how you can install WHMCS on your plus panel so first you have to upload your WHMCS file into your file manager like I have already uploaded then you have to extract this zip so like that and then go back to our main panel and create the database so simply you can click here to add database and put any name like WHMCS and create the user like the WHMCS if you want to put the same username and database user so you can choose here Then simply click here to yeah user had to access or uh, don't forget to mark this. So once you check this, then click on OK. I will copy the username because I had to enter it in you know, WHMCS. Okay, now database has successfully created in classic. Now if I go to my website dot in. this is uh, showing me the default page because uh, it is indexed in file manager somewhere let me delete this file where it is okay here this is the default one so let me put anything df default so I can remember it now if i will click it it will show me to install the whmcs okay so simply once you go here and click on i agree then begin to install and then enter your license and put your database name um, database name is also the database name because uh, password okay uh, and then click on continue and that's it system admin Like anything, I'll put my name Shahid. Uh, once you fill the all details, then simply I'll click on submit, and that's it. And also, don't forget to set up the corn job. To set up the corn job, you need this location path. So we will set it later. First, we will delete this. And yeah, delete it. Now I will go to admin panel. And now you can see you can log in easily into your WHNCS. 
So now you can see I have installed it um, on both in WHMCS and in cPanel. Sorry, uh, actually on the plus panel and the cPanel, I have installed it in both. So you can check here. This is uh, this WHMCS is hosted on uh, actually plus panel, and this one is uh, hosted on the cPanel one. So in next video, I will show you how you can uh, install the WHMCS on unmanaged server like Ubuntu or CentOS, but show with Ubuntu. So if you are new on my channel, so please don't forget to subscribe. And if you're unable to do that and you want to hire someone to complete this task for you, so you can hire me on Upwork or also on Fiverr, and you can also hire me on my website.